Hi guys, welcome to my Orchard videos. I guess I forgot to tell you guys uh, why I decided to upgrade to the uh, L3301. Well, I have good reason. I wanted to, I wanted a uh, bigger tractor to pursue uh, a side work, side businesses, side business, which I'll be starting, which I'm starting uh, here this year. So, um, just a tractor I can uh, multi-use it for both orchard and business. And I, uh, I felt with the B series I couldn't do that because I didn't have enough and enough implements. So, um, I loved my B series tractor. It was compact and it did everything I wanted it to do. To do, but I was get running into problems with, with weight issues. So the thing is, um, when hauling uh, fruit bins around the orchard, uh, hauling uh, two bins, say, sometimes I get a pinch because I'm uh, doing different things, and I haul two bins of fruit on the front and two bins in the back. I couldn't do that with the B series. Max would be one on the front and two on the back. Even that was kind of pushing it because of weight. But I me mean, for mowing and weed spraying, that little tractor is beautiful for that. You can't beat it. But things you have to think about is the weight, weight on the back of the machine. If you have a, a bigger, say if you, uh, say if you want to be more, um, uh, more efficient. It takes it take for instance if you're weed spray and you want to put a 400 liter tank uh, or a, a, a larger tank uh, some sorts or even a trailer type sprayer for weed spraying on the back of your tractor and you have a small compact you're not gonna have enough power like pulling power or even lifting power to uh, to handle the weight um, so those are just little factors I thought about and it was kind of, I was kind of really, really pushing the limit uh, with the capacity of the B series tractor. Oh, the, the B2620. I'm pretty sure if I'd gone to a larger size B series, it probably would have been better, but still, kind of limit on the chassis, right? So, um, you know, it, the B series tractor did everything I wanted to do, just the weight capacity I just wasn't enough. Better to have a little more. Weight kind of it depends on what you're doing. I mean, if you're gonna be using your tractor for landscaping or whatever it is, or even uh, your yard maintenance. I mean, um, around your property, you're almost a little bit on the light side with the B series tractor, but you know it is a good little tractor and it's gonna do everything you want with it uh, to an extent. Then you have to go to a bigger machine like a skid steer or whatever. So, um, you know, uh, I did try out the skid steer. I really like them, but my problem is getting in and out of the damn thing. And maybe a later date I'll have to, if I want to get a skid steer, maybe I'm gonna get, I have to get a JCB, which is side entry, as opposed to going over top. Man, I already banged up my knee and hit my knee right on the uh, front forks, and that really, <laughs> really, really buggered me up for quite a long time. So yeah, that was one of the factors I didn't get that, but um, just, you know, the L series gives me so many more options, and it's, a, it's so much more, and in reality, the uh, bare bones 30, 2501, the L, L series 2501 and 3301, bare bones tractors with the same price if not cheaper than the B series, believe it or not. It's a bigger tractor and it's cheaper. So th these are all factors, right? So uh, with the uh, L3301, I got, you know, my, I got my loader on it, I got a sweeper, I got my grapple, I got to the backhoe, I got a mower, a rotivator, all the, got a bunch of attachments that I still have any reviews on to show you guys. Half the stuff I just mentioned, you guys don't know what I'm talking about, but some guys do. So, um, it just, 
I decided to go this route and get the tractor with all the attachments I wanted, except for a couple. There's still a couple I still want. So, you know, it's just a better tractor all around and it'll, it'll make me money in the, in the future for my uh, business. And it'd be more heavier tractor for hauling bins and so forth around the orchard. Or orchards. So, yeah. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much why up I decided to upgrade was uh, I w wanted more implements and a heavier duty tractor for doing side work and uh, just general generally it's a more scum tractor for doing orchard work. The um, the B series tractor was kind of limited to do orchard work. I mean, it was like I said, I was, re I was really 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 pushing it a little bit too much uh, for orchard use so but anyway the very first B series tractor was the best the B7100 was the best it was actually more heavy duty than believe it or not it was actually built better than the uh, B2620 so these are just things so Anyways, hopefully we keep this one for a longer time, longer period of time, and, you know, run it, put it through its paces, and see how it goes, and I think I'm going to be, long, in the wrong, long run, I'm going to be a lot more happier with this tractor here, the L3301, just can do so much more. So there's a few more upgrades we want to do to it, and uh, tire-wise, too. mowing brush and stuff like that, you get tire flats and we're going to fix that situation. So, it's not to worry about ever getting a tire flat ever, getting a flat tire ever again. So, anyway, uh, thanks for watching my video. Sorry I didn't post up a, uh, a video on why I upgraded my tractor in the beginning, but I uh, apologize for that, just kind of got overwhelmed and when I needed my tractor to do stuff and I had to use it and I had to just get on with it. So uh, yeah, so thanks for watching my video. Thanks for your new subscribers, all the comments, likes and shares. Remember to uh, hit that that's, hit that subscriber button and also give me a like, give me a thumbs up on my videos. That helps, that would help me out a lot. And uh, yeah, so uh, if you have any questions uh, regarding the L3301 or other videos I have posted or any videos you'd be interested in seeing more of, please feel free to post that in the comments below. Alright, this is my Richard videos, over and out. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.